If you'd like to change up the look of that boring factory shift knob in your automatic equipped 2015 and newer Mustang, then you might want to consider adding this black option here from SR Performance. Now this option will combine a CNC aluminum base along with the black resin knob to help deliver that retro cue ball styling for around hundred bucks. Installation is going to get a strong one out of three wrenches on the difficulty meter here guys and take I would say at least 30 minutes maybe a little bit more to swap as we'll show you later in the video. So if you feel like manual guys get to have all the fun when it comes to aftermarket shift knobs well you'd be partially right. However thanks to companies like SR Performance there are a few different options out there including this one for both the 6R and 10R80 owners alike. Now the knob itself, in my opinion, is kind of a throwback to those classic or retro style cue ball shift knobs of the past, yet still works remarkably well even in the newer interiors of the modern S550s. Now if you're not quite sure of how this thing might look in your own ride, please, I encourage you, check out the dozens of customer submitted images on this one as you'll get a better sense of what the SR knob is all about in your interior. Now the SR Performance option will completely replace your boring factory shift knob with a combination of CNC aluminum for the base itself along with the release collar, while the centerpiece is no doubt going to be this black resin knob that's been polished to a beautiful shine. Now what's more is, you really can't tell here in the video, at least in the shot, but underneath a good light, there is a lot of metallic flake going on within that black resin and it's sure to look awesome in the interior of your car, especially once the sun hits that. But aside from the looks, the install itself is just about something anybody should be able to tackle with relative ease, as that one out of three wrench rating would otherwise indicate. But to give you a better idea of how things are gonna go down, check out our detailed walkthrough and tool breakdown right now. Tool used for this installation includes a stubby Phillips head screwdriver. Getting started with our SR Performance shift knob install, we have to remove our shifter bezel. Now you don't really need any tools to do so, uh, but what you need to do is kind of get rid of this little rubber coin tray holder and grab the front of the bezel and apply some pressure and then lift up. With our shifter bezel dislodged, now we just need to unplug this little plug down here. Uh, this basically supplies power to light up your letters for your automatic shifter in this case. So we're going to push and pull. Our next step is going to be to remove two screws on the front shifter here located underneath the boot. Now I found this step is a whole lot easier if you actually put the shifter back in the sport mode. This gives you a lot more room to operate. So to do so, have your key in the car with you, tap the engine start button one time with your foot off the brake. Now apply pressure to the brake pedal and slide the shifter back. With our shifter back in sport mode, now we can actually access the two Phillips head screws right here using our stubby Phillips head screwdriver. Be very careful not to drop these down into your shifter assembly. With our two screws removed, now we can remove the entire knob and shifter bezel assembly from the car. So now that we have our console and our SR Performance shift knob on the table, we're now gonna remove our factory shift knob from the boot and the shifter assembly and transfer our new knob in. To do so, there's a little black retainer clip here that's gonna hold your factory knob into the boot. We need to slide this out, and at that point, that'll allow us to remove the factory knob from the boot. So now that we have both knobs side by side together here on the table, you really get a good sense of how different they are. Now the factory knob, obviously not a bad choice, right? It's sharp, but at the end of the day, it's a factory knob, not that exciting overall. The SR Performance option, on the other hand, gives you kind of that throwback retro cue ball styling in black. And again, there's a lot of flake going on here. We make sure we get some good shots of that for you guys, but flake meaning there's some metallic bits to the actual black. Um, so it's not crazy over the top. If you wanted something like that, SR does make this again in red, which really does stand out along with the white option. But the black's a nice subtle option that, yes, it's aftermarket, but without being completely over the top. So enough talking, let's get this in the boot and back in the car. With our factory knob removed, now we got our SR Performance knob in hand. Want to make sure we orient the two screw holes towards the front of the shifter console. So we'll insert the knob through the boot now. Making sure we seat the leather boot here on the first lip of the collar, kind of like so. 
Now we can flip it over. Again, making sure our screw holes are facing forward. With the knob situated in the boot, now let's take it back in the interior and get it bolted up. All right, at this point, we're just going to slide the new SR Performance shift knob and shifter bezel over the factory shifter and get ready to secure our two screws. Now we're gonna take our two screws supplied by the SR Performance shift knob and reinstall them into the handle. And repeat that process with the second screw. With our two screws secured, now we can plug in the factory harness. And with the harness plugged in, now we can reinstall our factory shifter bezel. Last but not least, throw our rubber coin holder tray back in place. Ensure the shifter works as it should. And with the shifter back in park, our installation is complete. Now, never a bad idea to just put the shifter through some of the different gears, make sure everything works properly. But once that's complete, your installation's done. We hope you enjoyed this review and install of the SR Performance automatic shift knob here in black for your 2015 and newer automatic Mustang at home. And keep in mind, for more products and videos like this, keep it right here at AmericanMuscle.com.